Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to a new thing I'm uh, doing called One Minute Morsel. Uh, just going to read a little bit of scripture and share a thought or two. We'll see how that goes. Uh, this is Mark 15. And immediately, early in the morning, when the chief priests held the council with the elders and scribes, then the whole council, having bound Yeshua, led him away and delivered him up to Pilate. And Pilate questioned him, Are you the king of Yehudim? Answering, he says to him, So you are saying. And the chief priests were accusing him of many things, and Pilate was questioning him again, saying, Do you make no answer? See how many charges they bring against you? But Yeshua made no further answer, so that Pilate was amazed. Now during the feast, now during a feast, he used to release for them uh, any one prisoner whom they were asking to excuse. And the one being called Barabba had been con getting confined with fellow bandits, whoever had been committing murder in the bandit raid. And the crowd went up and began asking him to do as he is accustomed to do for them. And Pilate answered them, saying, Do you want that I have, shall I have released for you the king of the Udim? For he was aware that the chief priests had been delivering him up because of envy. You know, that's one thing, you know, um, even secular people can see the motives of religious people and, and um, religious motivations, whether it's in true and beauty and humility or for personal gain. And so yet the chief priest stirred up the crowd so that instead of, that he would release Baraba for them. And answering again, Pilate was saying to them, Then what will I have done with him you call the king of the Yudim? And they shouted back, Fasten him up in an execution timber. But Pilate was saying to them, Why? What evil has he done? But they shouted all the more, Fasten him up on an execution timber. And wishing to satisfy the crowd, Pilate released Baraba for them. And he handed Yeshua over, having scourged him, so that he could be fastened up on an execution timber. It is the religions of the world, whether it's the Judaic religions of the world or the syncretic um, religions of the world that execute Yeshua, whom you call Jesus. And this time of the year, there are many um, celebrations going on, equinox um, stuff and uh, fertility stuff. Uh, some of them are called uh, Ishtar, some are called Easter, and uh, they get bathed with religion and they call them Resurrection Sunday, Palm Sunday, um, Lent, which is a actually uh, a 40 day um, mourning period for Tammuz. And then there's the scripture, the feast, the called upon times. So I pray that you make the right decision on how to celebrate this time of year. Um, there's the way of Yeshua, the way of Jesus, and the way of his Father. And then there's the way of the Father of this world. Have a great day. Hi, Maisie Moo.